Hello ladies and gentlemen, Holotide here. This is gonna be a quick video. Um, I really try to shy away from making super negative videos and content and stuff like that, as you all know. I'm, I do critique, you know, 343, Halo, Microsoft when needed. And this is definitely one of those times. And it's, you know, regarding the hacking, cheating problem that is on Halo MCC. That being said, if you guys enjoy Halo content, make sure you subscribe. I know 90% of you who don't sub, look at this graph, it's so ugly. Let's make it more even. We could hit 15,000 subscribers. I could be your third favorite Halo YouTuber and there's only three left, so help a brother out. Anyways, there have been a ton of tweets and clips and stuff on Twitter talking about the cheating problem and I'm Kadaddle on Twitter said that hackers and Halo MCC are now able to ban other players from the game. Something needs to be done about this. I mean, if you, not not saying this is a content creator problem, but like if anybody tried to stream this game, they're just going to get hit off. They can steal your gamer tag, or not steal, but spoof your gamer tag and stuff like that. It's a problem. This is a big problem. It also, you know, when people are like, oh, if you like classic Halo so much, go play Halo MCC, and these people literally can't do that, there's a problem. Now, personally, I haven't played, I've played a couple games, I think, of like Halo 3 in the past like six months, but I really rarely get on MCC to play like multiplayer, it's more so to play mods and stuff like that, but this is a big deal to me. I, I think that Something has to be done. As somebody who loved Titanfall 2 and Titanfall 1 and watched what hackers did to that game for years, I cannot imagine that Microsoft and 343 want this to happen to, to Halo Infinite. I meant Halo MCC. That was a Freudian slip, I think. Anyways, there was a response from a 343 employee saying, hey folks, I just wanted to pop in and say that our support and safety team takes these reports seriously and have been actively investigating these as they are reported to them. If as part of the investigation it is determined we need some sort of development effort on our end to shore up future problems, we will have that discussion and determine what is feasible for us to commit to. Now, again, I don't blame this employee. I, it sounds like there's like, red tape bureaucracy stuff that goes around this and as somebody who works uh, in that capacity myself where there's a ton of people that have to agree and sign off on something and it takes months for anything to get done i'm sure it's not like you shouldn't blame him that employee he's just relaying the message and honestly that's probably more than what most companies would do but the only way to get something like this fixed is to complain and make noise and, you know, demand change. So that's basically what this video is. If anybody from 343 is watching, I, I wholeheartedly believe that you do not want the MCC to be broken and infested with cheaters and stuff like that. I'm not blaming 343 at all. Especially with how the cuts have happened, uh, you know, I'm sure there's a skeleton crew that probably maintains MCC at this point, and it's hard to combat stuff like this, but Microsoft, somebody, please help them out. Give them the resources. You cannot let a storied franchise like Halo turn into this. MCC should be celebrated, it should be maintained, it should be a shining example to the rest of the gaming industry how to you know preserve your roots and protect your history but that's gonna do it for the video ladies and gentlemen i told you i'd keep it short keep it sweet if you enjoyed it make sure you leave a like if you agree if you made it to the end of the video i want you to put halo 4 cortana feet in the comments yeah uh i'll catch you guys around the ring peace